Right, how do I get back to where that uh, human was? Did I wake you? You're an Esper? What's that pendant around your neck? I'll give it to you. A charm from the Esper world. The Esper world. So that's where I ended up. Everyone's at a loss as to how you, a human, could have made it into our world. You're the one who saved me, aren't you? My name is Madeline. I was sick of living in the human world. It's nothing but a pit of greed and hate. So I wandered out into the storm, and before I knew it, I was here. They say humans and espers can't coexist. Are you saying you don't want me here? No, I, I'm just not sure. I'll return to my own world tomorrow. All right, someone can show me show you the way. All right, someone can show you the way back. Stumbled there for a second. Okay. I guess I'm back here. Now I get to go find this human. Hi. A human already left. I wonder if she'll be all right without a guide. Already left, huh? What's wrong, Madeline? Oh, let's go. Let's just charge through the front gate. If you don't want to go back to your world, you're welcome to stay here. Humans and Espers can't be together. How can we know for sure unless we try for ourselves? How can we know for sure? Unless we. Try for ourselves. Was that what made Terra? I've chosen a name for her. What is it? Terra. It's beautiful, is it? So Terra is the... Uh, Alright, well, Terra is... I assume she would have some connection to being an Esper. So she's literally, quite literally, an Esper and a human combined. Yo, that's wild. Two years later... Humans! The nexus between our worlds has opened again. The storm is just like the one two years ago. But this is different from the time Madeline came here. This one brings with an army that seeks our magical powers. This is no good. Retreat to the Elder's house. Aha! I finally found it. Oh, it's Gestalt! After all that time spent decoding the secrets of those ancient texts. Now it's time to re the rewards. I say reap. Grab them, richest handy men who captures an Esper. Go! Insane. So these are Terra's parents, so to speak. Terra's alright. We have no choice. We must do the very thing we've been avoiding. You mean the magic barrier? I'll create a tempest to sweep all the invaders out of our realm, then I'll seal the gate. Even among espers, the power to create a magical seal is limited to a single bloodline. I'm the last of that line. But at your age, I may not survive. And without me, you'll never be able to open the gate. Bad line. The other world holds nothing for me. And it's decided. We have no other choice. This is about Terra. Terra's alright. Never mind, it's not. Alright. This is all because of that human woman. Nonsense. She could have led them here for all we know. Enough. She's one of them. It'll only be a matter of time before she decides she wants our power. Oh no! Ba, 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 
Where are you going? Madeline, she... Oh no, but it's already too late. I've begun activating the seal. You won't be able to return. I don't care. Yeah, you, you get him, Madeline. However you... Madeline? I don't even know how to pronounce his name. I moved up with the stick in the advanced dialogue. I'm sorry. Oh, just when the ultimate treasures was within my grasp. All right, Gestal. See you later, loser. And no, we'll see you in another timeline, unfortunately. Madeline, I'm nothing like them. I know. Thank you. Will you come back home with me? Yeah, of course. Terra! And that's how Terra went to the human world. Madeline! Oh, uh, and you. I guess all of us did. What do we have here? A human woman? And a babe? Leave my daughter alone. Your daughter? Hmm, then she must be the product of a human and, uh, how fascinating. Wahaha! <laughs> it looks like, like, bleh, words. Looks like my dreams of building an empire may come true sooner than I imagined. No. Quiet. Oh my word. This world will be mine to rule. Not if Kefka beats you to it. Yo, Gasol literally is a Romalian general. Oh, hey, Terra. Back to your uh, human design, I see. Is that father's? So I'm the daughter of an Esper and a human. That's why I have these abilities. I should be okay now. I can control this power as long as I only use it in short bursts. Star already knew the secret of the Esper's power back then. Those Esper's in the research facility must have been the ones they grabbed that day. And Celeste's power came at the expense of one of them. The Empire won't get away with this. I'll hit the Emperor with a blitz or two. Yeah, save and you get him. How are things in Narsh? Maybe we should head back and see. The airship's ready to go. Come on. Era's back, baby! Oh, this is it. They're gonna let me roam around with this, huh? Oh, by all means, take a turn at the wheel. Let me teach you how to fly. Press confirm button to move forward, change course with left and right, adjust the altitude, I'll kind of figure it out as I go. Oh, yeah, we can switch party members now at the airship. Cool, 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 I got it. Sure. Press and hold the L and R buttons while using directional pads to move without changing the view. Changing the way the airship's facing. This is especially useful when landing. Press left and L. Alright. Well, we have our airship. Next stream is going to be a ton of exploring then. Uh, I do want to get Terra reacquainted. I definitely want to use Terra. I'm not sure who they're gonna make me use, but I want to bring in some characters that I want to use. Um, how do I... Don't do a thing. How do I... I probably should have listened to him when he said, add party members. Yeah, I'll get stronger on Bell. Oh, you just talked to someone. Okay. Uh, definitely want to use Terra. They caught her up a little bit, which is nice. Uh, Terra? Definitely Setzer as well. Maybe Setzer, Sabin, Edgar? Maybe we could try that. Uh, those not in my party. A lot of I gotta do a lot of stuff with Terra here. Take the stone blade. Who's physical and magical power? 
barrier ring? Stack barrier rings, I think. Take the gold. You can take the golden equipment that uh, Celeste had, which is nice. Oh, he uses cards. Uh, buh, buh, buh. What was that thing that like raised attack or something? We can get us gloves on you. Hyper risk, we can do that. Now for Espers. Oh my word! They really just gave us a ton of Espers at once. Carbuncle, Bismarck, had a had a bleep boss? Kind of bleep boss is a new one for Final Fantasy. Maduin, okay. Yo, we have a ton of espers now. Oh my word. This is gonna be interesting. <laughs> Trying to level all these up. Oh, but some overlap. Uh, Terra go on Maduin because it makes sense. This is gonna be interesting. And Unicorn! Dude, they gave us a couple. Bio Break and Death, HP plus 10. Uh, keep Ifrit just to get, uh, might as well finish Drain. Cura, Asuna, Protect. Ooh, definitely gonna want a character that does supportive stuff. So let's actually have you on Unicorn. And for Edgar here. Bismarck. Oh, Raze. Cool. Let's try to get Raze ASAP with someone. Alright. So, we have Espers now. Um, I'm gonna try. I know there's no bench XP in this game. We're gonna kind of see how it goes leveling other characters up simultaneously. It might not go so well. If it doesn't go so well, I'll just pick a party and stick with it. Probably. But I'm pretty sure FF6 is a very... It's a game that, like, kind of encourages you to switch a lot because of like certain story events with certain characters so i don't know how it's gonna go and with espers and such you know i might need to do some grinding in between streams if it gets like really like oh hard to figure out how to get a certain skill or something we're gonna kind of you know play the game and see what happens basically actually let me we don't have much time now uh let me just look really quick did the flashback Blackjack Exploration. This is the part where they mention, uh... This is where they mention going around the world. Yeah, Terra suggests to return to Narsh. There's a side quest that lets us recruit a secret character in Narsh. There's an item shop in the Blackjack. You could buy Seraph. You could buy an Esper and Zen. Ooh, there's a lot to do here. I'm gonna have to go through this really long list of doing stuff. That's gonna be fun. I'm actually really excited for next stream. For now. Um. Let's do a battle. I want to actually see that uh, command that Terra got. I think she got like a new command. She could do that uh, that transform or something. Let's just go to an island and try fighting. Like, why not, right? I don't want to start tackling side stuff yet. I just want to like, that's a really good way to end the stream. Just be like, oh, we just did the magic facility. We saved Terra. And next stream, we could just start diving into intermission stuff. And we'll move on to story, obviously. There's not like a lot. There's not, like, a lot that we're not going to move on the story. There's definitely a good bit that will take, like, an hour. Hour minimum. Maybe two hours to do stuff. Oh, this is so cool. This is so neat. I'm a sucker for airships like this. 
this island right here. Let's see what this is about. I just want to, like, fight somewhere for a little bit. Also, the view of the airship looks really nice. I just want to do, like, a quick battle or something and kind of, like, get some AP, maybe, and see what's up here. Leaf Bunny. Trance. Yup, that's your uh, unique action. Really cool, really cool. Oh, no AP. This is a really weak area. Hang on. We gotta go somewhere better. This is the, uh, this is where we met Gao, right? This region right here, I think? It's like nowhere good to grind AP. Alright. going to Narsh. There's some stuff in Narsh I want to go take a look at. We can go, like, to Narsh really quickly because we don't have time. I don't want to, like, start diving to side content yet. Save that for next stream. I love the view of the airship. Like, the way it looks when you land in something. So cool. been waiting for you please follow me don't thrust me into a long cutscene <laughs> oh you're finally here people of nauseous finally decide to fight the empire how things go in vector i see we've been trying to work out a plan to make use of nauseous resources and Figaro's machinery but we just don't have enough troops to storm the empire we have no choice but to open the sealed gate. You mean the gate to the Esper world? We'll never beat the Empire without their help. Sealed gate lies to the Empire's east. When we oh, that was that east area I saw, I think. When we open it, the Espers can attack from there while we launch an invasion from the north. An attack on two fronts. We must reestablish the bonds of trust that once existed between humans and Espers. The Espers must be made to understand, and there's only one among us who can make them. Terra. If humans and Espers were truly incompatible, I would never have been born. I'll do it. I'm the only one who can. Okay, is that it? Do I just go... If we can get the Espers to understand, we can put an end to the war once and for all. Terra, I know you can do it. Sealgate lies far to the east of the Empire's east. Far to the Empire's east, but they keep it under tight surveillance to find a way to get through. Alright, so I think I know where that is. Now we are left with no choice but to take up arms against the Empire. I suppose this was inevitable. Alright, that seems like a good, like, oh, you're supposed to go here. A good time to, uh... Good time to be like, oh, good time to, like, you know, do intermission stuff, but we know where to go. Now, what we got at the relic shop here? Hermes sandals, black belt, nothing really worth. You could buy Hermes sandals? I don't think you could have bought them before. That sounds new. Alright, nothing here is like, hey, buy it. Maybe some items, because I used quite a bit in the Magitech facility. I definitely need green cherries. It comes up a lot in this game. That'll do it. 
All right, well, we are done with stream in four hours, which is good. We're 11 hours in the game. 11 hours in the game, we have the airship, so that's uh, really something. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna be it. Those of you watching, hope you all enjoyed. When we come back next time, um, I don't want to say side quests, but exploration. We're gonna, like, just go to a couple of areas. It shouldn't take all stream, though. So we will see what's up with the sealed gate later in the stream. But I do want to, like, explore a bit with the airship. It'll be really fun. Uh, but yeah, great time. Thank you all for watching. See you all next time.